At the end of the book of Acts, Paul had been arrested and was being taken to Rome to be tried by Caesar. The authorities handed Paul over to a centurion and he boarded a ship and set sail. They sailed for many days until suddenly a great storm came upon the sea. The winds and the waves were so great that the sailors were afraid that the ship would break. They began to throw cargo and food overboard. Then Paul stood up and began to talk to the sailors. He said that God had spoken to him in a dream and that he had good news. None of the sailors would be lost in the storm. They were all going to be okay. When it was daylight, the sailors saw an island in the distance. They began to sail towards it, but their ship struck a sandbar and got stuck. The waves beat against the ship so that it began to break apart. The captain told everyone to jump overboard and swim towards the land. Paul and all the sailors made it safely to the shore. They realized that they had landed on an island called Malta. The people there were very kind to Paul and his companions, and they helped them. That night, as Paul was gathering some firewood, a snake leapt out and bit Paul. The people were afraid that Paul would be hurt, but God protected Paul. There wasn't even a mark on his hand. Paul knew that God wanted him to teach about Jesus in Rome. The people of Malta gave Paul and the sailors everything they needed, and they set sail again. This time, they finally reached Rome. Paul thanked God for his protection and began to tell many people about Jesus. Some people didn't listen to Paul's message and became angry with him. However, other people trusted in Jesus as their Savior and Lord and joyfully praised God for saving them from their sin.